All right, welcome to Mark Dodd Photography or American Kiwi Photo Photography, depending upon how you got to me. Today, I'm going to do a tutorial on cleaning the camera, or specifically cleaning the uh, CCD panel. Um, got my Nikon D80 here. Um, a little dusty on the outside here. Um, but I've discovered that some of my pictures have a small blotch on the uh, top part of the picture. I'm just going to turn it on. We'll see if we can show you what the blotch looks like. Dust off the back here. And I've taken a couple test shots of the blotch. Um, I happen to know where it is on here, so I am going to zoom in. And we'll go up to the top. It's kind of hard to actually see on this camera, so I'll do a, a screenshot later on of a picture from my computer, but it's right here, right above my finger. I don't know if you can actually see it or not, but it, it's there. So I know I need to clean the uh, CCD panel on my camera. So we're going to go ahead and do that today. So I'm going to turn the camera off for now. Um, if it's not obvious, my camera's a little dusty, so first I'm going to clean off the outside of it. I'm just going to use a, a dust rag here because once we open it up we want as little dust as possible to be in the environment. Uh, the other thing I forgot to say is the surface that you're going to work on make sure it's clean first and you've got plenty of light around because you're going to need the light to be able to see. So let me just finish dusting off the camera here. All right, so first we're gonna to have to take off the lens. So we'll just push the button, turn my lens, we'll take the lens, we'll just set that off to the side because we don't need that. We're gonna take a quick look on the inside of the camera here. Let's see if I can adjust the thing here. We'll take a look and we can see down into the uh, camera, we can see the, the mirror here. A little bit dusty there, so I'm going to blow the, this part of it out first. We've got a, uh, I don't quite know how to say it, Giotto blower here. Uh, the thing I like about these is not only is it a, a big blower, nice tip, clean, it, all, it also has a filter built into the bottom of this, so when it sucks air in, it um, filters out the dust. So I'm going to go ahead and just blow out any dust from this area of the camera. Now, to get to the CCD panel, we're going to have to open up this mirror to get behind it. Um, most of your cameras will have some settings somewhere that will let you keep the mirror open. So I'm going to turn on my camera here. We're going to go to the menu. And you can look it up in your manual to see where exactly it is on your camera. Um, I don't remember off the top of my head where it is on mine, so I am going to go through the menus until I find the right one. And here it is. It's called Mirror Lockup on my Nikon D80. So I'm going to turn it on, choose OK, and like it says, when the shutter button is pressed, the mirror lifts and the shutter opens. So I am going to hit the button. Now that when we flip the camera back around, we can actually see the CCD panel down here. Now, looking at it, I can actually see some um, dirt sitting on the CCD panel. But uh, what I'm going to do first is use the blower just to blow off any dust. Um, when you put the blower in, make sure that you do not touch that CCD panel with the, the end tip. Um, a lot of people recommend, and, and so do I, that 
you flip the camera upside down when you're blowing it out. That way dust will fall down. So I'm going to go ahead and try that right now. All right, let's see. get in the corner. Let's see, can't quite show it to you. Let's see if I can angle the light here so we can get to it. Angle the light in here. For most purposes, that usually gets everything that you need. But in this case, I already know that uh, I've done that before and it doesn't do the trick. So let's see if we can see what it did do and what it didn't do. Yeah, I've still got some dirt down there on the, the sensor. So the next part is we need a sensor cleaning kit. I've gotten this one from um, B&H Photo. It's a uh, visible dust cleaning kit. It has the swabs along with the cleaning fluid that we're going to use. So we'll go ahead and open this up. We'll say this is the first time I'm doing this, so I am a little bit nervous about doing it. I'm sure you are too, or else you would not be watching this video. So we're going to take out the instructions. We have to get the, the cleaning fluid here out. We'll set this off to the side. All right, so we got our cleaning fluid, and we've got our um, wand here, cleaning sensor wand. So I always recommend read the instructions. So we've got it. First part, what they've got on here is we're going to moisten the applicator on both ends and you can see on these instructions you can see the thing actually sucking up the moisture and then it actually shows you wiping from one side to the other and here's a whole whole list of other products that they sell for for help cleaning your camera so we'll give this a shot first part on this bottle um, I really don't know what the purpose is of the, the blue tube piece because it's not listed on their instructions. I'm going to go ahead and open up this bottle here. I'm trying not to spill any of the liquid anywhere. And we're going to open up a swab. Make sure that you don't touch the white end of the swab. That's what's going to be going on to your sensor. So you want to keep that as clean as possible. I've actually gone to their website and they recommend blowing off the end of it after you take it out of the wrapper. So we're going to go ahead and do that just in case there's some small fibers on there that got loose from when it was in packing. So, all right, let's see if we can get the ends here. All right, see the fluid going into it. We'll do it to the other side as well. Sucked up the fluid. Set that to the side. Now you want to make sure that you don't get this dry. So we're going to go down in here. I'm going to bring the light down because I actually need to see what I'm doing. So we're going to go in. Turn it to the side. Because you want to, you're going to be doing this kind of motion. We're going to take it down just to the top of the lamp, above the panel, take it to the side, and then going to do one wipe from left to right. Take it down there. Got it on the panel. I'm going to do one wipe across the panel. And that looks like it might have gotten it. Although I'm I'm not doing it on, on this instance. Um, 
they say um, you can actually do one wipe on the other side of the applicator on the way back. I've seen that on some videos, but I'm, I'm not going to do that in this case. That because I just figured out that I lost which way was which. All right. So that's how you can clean your sensor. Now that it's all clean, we'll hit the camera button again to turn the camera off and it'll close the mirror. So let me do that real quick. And the mirror is back down. Well, thank you for watching this quick tutorial on how to clean your camera sensor.